imagine you've been dating a woman for a while, and things seem to be going great. She's charming, beautiful, and you can't get enough of her. But then, little by little, you start noticing some odd behaviors. She's always making excuses about her whereabouts, her phone is constantly buzzing with calls she doesn't answer, and she's evasive about her personal life. That's when the nagging suspicion starts to creep in, could it be that you're the other man, and she's not as single as she claims to be? Fellas, being the other man is a precarious situation that no one should ever find themselves in, but the harsh reality is that it happens more often than you might think. Whether you've been willingly led astray or have stumbled into this situation unknowingly, it's crucial to recognize the signs before you get in too deep. So, let's dive right in and explore the clues that might indicate you're the other man to a married woman. One, the mysterious schedule. When a woman's schedule is constantly shifting and filled with unexplained absences or last minute cancellations, it raises major red flags. This erratic behavior could be a clear sign that she's juggling two lives, one with you and another with a husband and family you know nothing about. Her excuses for rescheduling dates or disappearing for hours or days at a time may seem plausible on the surface. But if you take a step back and look at the bigger picture, a pattern of deception may emerge. Perhaps she claims to be working late or attending family events, but the frequency and inconsistency of these excuses don't add up. It's important to remember that a busy schedule alone doesn't necessarily indicate infidelity. Many people lead hectic lives with demanding careers or personal commitments. However, when coupled with other suspicious behaviors, such as emotional distance or secrecy about her personal life, these scheduling mysteries could be a glaring sign that she's living a double life. 2. The Unavailable Hours Closely related to her mysterious schedule are the specific times when she seems to be consistently unavailable or unreachable. If she's always tied up or incommunicado during weekday evenings or weekend mornings, it could be a clear indication that she's prioritizing her time with her husband and family during these typical homebody hours. A married woman's schedule often revolves around her family commitments, such as spending evenings at home with her spouse or attending family activities on weekends. During these times, she may become virtually unreachable, either by not answering your calls or texts or by providing vague excuses about being busy with work or other obligations. 3. The Evasive Answers In any relationship, open and honest communication is key. However, if the woman you're dating consistently gives vague or evasive answers when you ask questions about her personal life, it could be a major red flag that she's being dishonest about her relationship status. A single woman should have no problem sharing details about her family, living situation, or personal interests. However, if she deflects or changes the subject entirely when you broach these topics, it could be because the truth, that she's actually married, could unravel her web of lies. Pay close attention to how she responds to seemingly innocent questions about her life. Does she provide clear and detailed answers, or does she give vague generalities that leave you with more questions than answers? Does she seem uncomfortable or anxious when discussing certain topics, or does she skillfully steer the conversation in a different direction? Four, the lack of personal details. Along the same lines as evasive answers is a complete lack of personal details about the woman you're dating. If she's never shared any information about her family, living situation, or even her last name, it could be because she's trying to maintain a strict separation between her affair with you and her marriage. In a healthy, open relationship, partners typically share details about their lives, families, and backgrounds. However, if the woman you're seeing remains tight-lipped about these aspects of her life, it could be because she's trying to prevent you from discovering her true marital status. Think about it, if she were to share details about her family or living situation, it could potentially reveal that she's not as single as she claims to be. Even something as simple as revealing her last name could be a risk if you were to Google it and discover her marital status. 5. The restricted access. Have you ever been to her place? If not, that's a major red flag that you might be the other man. 
A married woman involved in an affair will likely keep her living space off limits to avoid any potential run-ins with her husband or evidence of her true marital status. In a typical dating scenario, it's common for partners to eventually visit each other's homes or living spaces. However, if the woman you're seeing has consistently made excuses or refused to let you into her personal space, it could be because she's trying to prevent you from discovering any evidence of her marriage. A married woman's home is likely filled with signs of her marital status, family photos, shared belongings, and perhaps even her husband's presence. Allowing you into the space could potentially expose her deception and blow her cover. Six, the suspicious jewelry. Pay close attention to any rings the woman you're dating wears, especially on her left ring finger. The presence of a ring on that finger is a clear sign that she's married or has been married in the past. While it's possible she's divorced or widowed, it's still a detail that should raise questions, especially if she's never mentioned a previous marriage. Even if she's not wearing a ring, look for tan lines or indentations on her finger that could indicate she recently removed one. Some married women might remove their rings when they're with their lover but keep them on at other times to avoid suspicion from their husbands. 7. The Coded Language Listen carefully to how the woman you're dating refers to her personal life. Does she use ambiguous terms like my situation or my circumstances instead of more definitive language? A married woman engaged in an affair will often use coded language to avoid directly addressing her marital status. For example, instead of saying I'm going home to my husband, she might say something like, I have to get back to my situation. Or, instead of referring to her spouse by name, she might use a vague term like my partner. This coded language is a way for her to acknowledge her complicated personal life without directly admitting to being married. It allows her to maintain a level of plausible deniability and avoid directly lying to you, while still keeping the truth hidden. 8. The Emotional Distance While the woman you're dating may seem affectionate and attentive when you're together, take note if she maintains a certain emotional distance. A married woman involved in an affair may struggle with fully investing her emotions, as her heart is already tied to someone else, her husband. On the surface, she may appear to be a loving and caring partner, showering you with affection and attention. However, if you look closely, you may notice a subtle emotional detachment or unwillingness to fully open up and connect on a deeper level. This emotional distance could manifest in a variety of ways. Perhaps she's hesitant to make future plans or discuss long-term commitments. Or, maybe she seems distant or distracted during intimate moments, as if her mind is elsewhere. 9. The Secret Phone Habits Pay close attention to her phone habits, as they can be a major giveaway that she's hiding something, like a marriage. Does she constantly leave the room to take calls? Does she guard her phone like it's a closely guarded secret, keeping it face down or constantly checking it when you're together? A married woman involved in an affair will likely go to great lengths to keep her communications hidden from you, as her phone could hold incriminating evidence of her double life. She may feel the need to take calls in private, away from your prying eyes and ears, to avoid accidentally revealing details about her marriage or conversations with her husband. 10. The Unexplained Expenses If you've noticed unexplained expenses or a sudden influx of cash or gifts, it could be a sign that she's being financially supported by her husband. A married woman involved in an affair may have access to her spouse's financial resources, allowing her to maintain a lifestyle you may not be able to afford on your own. Perhaps she's always treating you to lavish dinners or expensive outings, or maybe she's suddenly able to afford luxuries that seem out of reach for someone in her profession. While it's possible she's simply doing well financially, it's also worth considering the possibility that she's supplementing her income with her husband's money. 11. The Emotional Roller Coaster Finally, take note of her emotional state. Does she seem constantly distracted, anxious, or even depressed at times? The emotional toll of living a double life can be immense, and the guilt, stress, and fear of being caught can manifest in mood swings and emotional instability. One moment, 
She may seem happy and carefree in your presence, but the next, she's withdrawn and plagued by a dark cloud of worry or sadness. These emotional ups and downs could be a result of the constant stress and anxiety she's experiencing from juggling her affair with her marriage. The fear of being caught by her husband, the guilt of betraying her vows, and the internal conflict of loving two people at once can create a perfect storm of emotional turmoil. She may be putting on a brave face when she's with you, but the weight of her deception is likely taking a toll on her mental and emotional well-being. If you've recognized several of these clues, it's time to have an honest conversation with yourself. Are you willing to be the other man, knowingly or unknowingly, participating in the deception and potential destruction of a marriage? If the answer is no, then it's time to confront her about her marital status and be prepared to walk away if the truth is too much to bear. However, if you find yourself in the unfortunate situation of being the unwitting other man, don't be too hard on yourself. Sometimes, despite our best efforts, we can be misled by skilled liars and manipulators. The important thing is to extract yourself from the situation as soon as you become aware of the truth, as continuing down that path will only lead to more heartache and potential legal consequences. In the end, being the other man to a married woman is a precarious and emotionally charged situation that no one should willingly put themselves in. The damage it can cause to not only the marriage but also to your own sense of self-worth and integrity is immeasurable. If you find yourself in this position, whether knowingly or unknowingly, it's crucial to have the courage to confront the truth and make the difficult decision to walk away. You deserve a partner who is fully committed to you, without the baggage of a secret life or a betrayed spouse. Trust your instincts, fellas, and never settle for being someone's second choice or hidden affair. Your worth is far greater than that, and the right woman is out there, waiting for you to find her, without the weight of a marriage hanging over your relationship.